Hey folks, uh, thanks for tuning in to another one of my how-to videos. Today what I want to do is make a greaser for your ATV wheel bearings. So if you're like me, you like playing in the mud, but the problem is these bearings, uh, they get so jammed up with mud, you can take them out in just one season, which is what happened to these guys. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take this chunk of uh, leftover aluminum that I have, and I'm going to make a greaser. So the idea behind this is, it's going to slide in between the two halves of the inner part of the bearing and there'll be a little spout kind of on the side that's going to squirt the bearing in between the crack there and lubricate your bearings. Alright, let's uh, head over to the lathe and start turning this guy. Okay folks, just finished up with this bearing greaser. You can see it turned out pretty nice. I have the grease zerk installed on the one end, my rubber o-rings are in, and I have that uh, slot cut so that the grease can come out down through the channel that I drilled. Now inside the bearing you can see the two halves, the two inner halves uh, separate and that's where the grease is going to be injected into these bearings. So if this was installed into your uh, suspension upright, it would look something like this when it's all assembled. Of course that bearing would be sitting inside here. Right, so you'll get on there with your grease fitting and you can uh, pump some grease in there. So let's try it out see how it works. Okay, let me show you how this greaser works. 
I've already got ahead and disassembled the front steering on my Razor unit. So you'll need to take the brake caliper off so that you can remove your hub so you can get access to your bearing. Now the nice thing about this is you don't need to remove your axle shaft because it's going to slide right through. So what you do, push this guy on in. Oh, takes a bit of force. All right, take your grease gun, connect it up, and just give it, uh, start giving it squirts of grease. Alright, there we go, you can see it's already pushing the old grease out. Now we'll just keep going, make sure we've got all fresh grease in there. Twist this around, distribute it a bit more on the other side. There we go. Oh, yeah. yeah, push that old junk right out. Okay, that should be good. Pull that off. Pull this out. Oh, that's snug. There we go. It's messy, but uh, you can tell it's working. I'm pushing the old stuff out. All right, folks, it's as simple as that. Well, I hope you enjoyed that, folks. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, just make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, and make sure you subscribe to my channel. All right, thanks a lot for watching, folks.